Father, we Amen. release your fire into Paula. Lord is removing thoughts that should not be in your mind. Thank you, Father. Anxiety. The enemy talks to you. Father, we catch these thoughts. We bring it all to the obedience of Jesus Christ. We pull him down. Lately, it's been worse because he knows today you're having an encounter with Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Do you have any, do you have any numbness in your right arm by any chance? I sure do. Girl, I, have, I have been feeling this since like 15 you know, minutes before I got on the call with you. I, I, this is the fourth time I feel like I'm getting shot in the arm with an arrow and, yeah. uh, and it's yeah. biting me in the neck. Something's yeah. biting me but in Father, the neck. Father, we, we come against all of that in Jesus' name. Let the blood flow. Thank you, Lord. Yeah, there's stuff. There, this, is much, this is much more than just your initial prayer. So if we let God be God, thank you. He's cutting you free. Thank you, Father, for healing in her belly. Fire of God is in your belly, Paula. Thank you, Jesus. Diabetes has run in your family. Uh, yeah, um, this was considered juvenile diabetes for me anyway. Yeah, it has run um, in your family. Yeah, thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Entered the bones. The bone marrow makes the blood, and there's... There's the line right there. Thank you, Jesus. Fire. Purge every organ, Lord, in her. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Mm. Every organ, Father. Father, everything in the bowels within her, we ask for your light to enter in Jesus' name. Beautiful winds of healing are all around you, Paula. Thank you, Jesus. Purge her, Lord, of all unrighteousness, from her bloodlines and her family. Everything of the enemy out, we break all soul ties, curses on these soul ties. Oh, in Jesus' name, all poisons come out of her now. In Jesus' name. What do you sense the Lord is doing, Paula? Getting lightheaded. Mm. That's the poisons are coming out of you. Mm -hmm. Feeling lightheaded. Especially on the a right little, side. A little chills. A little yeah. chills. Yeah. Right of here, course. right side, back of your neck. Come out in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Oh, poisons are coming out of you. Thank you, Lord. I have some bleeding in my left eye. Had Father, restore the nerves. Restore everything that the enemy has done in your temple in Jesus' name. I'm feeling chills. Yeah. Thank you. I feel jitter like I'm shivering. Mm hmm. Thank you. Sure. Father, I command death off this family, premature death off this family, death off her anointing, death off her prayers being answered, death off of miracles happening in her life. I command death in every form off of this life in Jesus mighty name, all occult witchcraft off the mind in Jesus name. Father, all curses from Ireland, Scotland, and Italy be broken off this family and Russia. Father, I come against that giant you're showing me in Jesus' name. We bind him hands and feet with the chains of heaven. This has been like constant oppression to you. So much so that I'm not even, I'm in it for so long that I'm not even aware that I'm in it. Mm, thank you, Lord. I'm, it's become normal. That's because you have a call on your life. You have gifts of healing inside of you. Thank you, Father, for removing the enemy's nets off of her. Antichrist, death, hell, and the grave, loose her feet. I'm a dancer. Mm, they don't like Dance. it. I haven't danced in a while. That's because worship is a weapon. Your feet are free. Your feet are free now, sister. <laughs> sister. <laughs> They're free now. I, like I love that. Mm. That's because I saw what was bothering you. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure I said that out loud. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. Thank you, Lord. Father, I command all giants of fear out of her right now in Jesus' name. All self-loathing and self-hatred, I bind you. I hear your words. I see fear has been talking to you. Yeah. I'm not talking about your adult life. I'm talking about as a young girl. Thank you, Father, that you have cursed diabetes in Jesus' name. 
We command the self-loathing and the self-hatred out. She wants to live. She's going to live. She is going to live. She is going to declare the works of the Lord. She is going to dance for the Lord. She is going to praise the Lord. She's going to worship the Lord and the enemy is going to back off. Thank you for lifting the heaviness off of your daughter right now in Jesus' beautiful name. Destiny was written in your life. Oh, thank you, Lord. We open ourselves to all of your possibilities, Lord, and we know nothing is impossible for those who believe. And we believe, Father, we believe that your health has re-entered your daughter's blood, her bones, every organ in Jesus' name. This is gone. The numbness is gone, yeah. The, the pain, yeah. Yeah, how long did you suffer with that? This has been for a couple of months mm. and I used to have it, you know, it's gone back and forth. Mm. Um, this is good, a little bit tight still. Yeah, but and you didn't even ask for that. <laughs> Sorry. No, no, it's it's Jesus. I I love that. No. No. <laughs> Heaviness out of her chest right now in Jesus' name. You have a lot to say, but you hold back. Even though you do speak, you hold back because the heaviness has been trying to silence you. The Lord is removing that right now. It's actually a demonic weapon. I'm not being heard. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. The Lord is removing that fiery dart right now. Thank you, Jesus. I, I sometimes felt like I, I'm not important enough for him to work on. He's busy. The world has got so much. What, I'm just little. Paula, little. You know, little Paula. Fiori, small. You know, it's, it's like, and, I, and I've been thinking about that lately, about, no, you're big. You're strong. You know what you are to Jesus? You're his inheritance. You are his inheritance for eternity. Is that big enough for you? It's almost too big. I don't know. To, I don't know. How to you know, you know, it's we, like we can go, we can go through so much hard time in life yeah. and Jesus heals us in a second. And then we may need another two calls just to learn how to yeah. live without yeah. the mess. Yeah. Because he changes your whole existence. He takes he, the past. He envelops your present and yeah. boom, you've got a new future in a breath. It's who God is. In a breath. Mm. Love that. Mm. I love that. He has, he has definitely worked in my life and I've seen it. He yeah. Has saved my, he has saved my life. Yeah. He has protected me. Mm. That's who he has is. spoken in my heart and he has given me some dreams, you know, things I'm trying to learn about that. Images and follow, trying to follow through. You might feel a shaking within you, Paula. Thank you. The Lord is breaking strongholds between you and your husband. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And the son, father. How many? You have two girls. You have two boys. I have a, I have a boy and a girl from Russia. Okay. But they're not related. They're and not they, related. they don't relate. And they don't relate. Yeah. That they're just not right. Yeah. I mean, even there's anger between the two of them. Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, today, today, thank you, Jesus. Slava Bogo. Thank you, Father. Here goes the kids. Father, we break the dark crowns of the enemy off the kids. Weapons and writings out and off in Jesus' name. Abandonment on the boy and the girl. Rejection on the girl. Thank you, Lord. Oh, such fierce strongness on the boy. Thank you, Father. Put that in balance, Lord, for the kingdom of heaven. Break the bondage off the feet. Thank you, Jesus. Why do you say the feet? Mm, the walk. Mm. Why? I'm curious. Why the feet? Because the enemy wants to stop our walk. Okay, so the Lord is dealing with the daughter right now. Thank you, Father. Father, everything in the mind. Thank you, Father. We break mental illness off this family line in Jesus' name. Mm, such oppression. Thank you, Jesus. Breakthrough, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. How old are they? She's, Sasha is 18 and mm. Jared is 22. Mm, thank you, Father, for this call today. 
just in time. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. They're being delivered. Thank you, Lord. Separate it from them, Father. Father, we break the strong of hatred in this family off in Jesus' name. Thank you. Father, fill that area with your peace in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Wow. Praise you, Jesus. What do you sense the Lord is doing, Paula? He's just breaking down these strongholds. He's, yes, he is. Father, we thank giving, you. You giving me clarity. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. He's uncovering things I've never thought about or seen. Yeah. That's but, known, we, but I felt. Holy Spirit. This is the pro This is the issue. Thank you, Jesus. It is. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Ooh. Okay, fires of healing and yielding. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, the minds. Thank you, God. What are you feeling right now? Just again, the shivering. Yeah, thank you. The shivering. Mm. Not knowing is that good or bad. You know mm. what I have felt that is that. Oh, I'll good? tell you exactly what it is. The Lord is burning this stuff up, but the cold you feel is the anesthetic from heaven. So you can handle what the Lord <laughs> is doing yeah. in your family because you are standing in the gap for your husband and the kids. Thank you, Lord. I have been. Peace. Thank you, Lord. This is the Lord overtaking the battle. There's always been a false sense of responsibility growing up for my mother, having to help her. That was the curse. Yeah, it's gone. Thank you. Thank you. It also silenced your voice. It's lifting off now. Oh, God, you're so amazing. Thank you. Bands of witchcraft off the kids. Thank you. Off the husband as well. Words spoken. I am seeing fire coming out your husband's mouth. Thank you, Jesus. Anchor. That's the anger coming out. Thank you, Lord. Your husband have pain? Yes. Back, lower. Um, he's having some pain in his arm. He's stiff. He has some neck a lot of neck stuff going on. He has a he has something pinched in his lower back. Thank you, Lord, for healing him right now in Jesus' name. He's had, you know, he's had hip surgeries. He's had I knew two it was the, around the hips. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Lord. So you have many gifts in you that you have no idea about. And now that this curse is lifted off of you, we ask God to Holy Spirit. We just, it's too late. He already is. I can't even talk fast enough. Thank you. Holy I know. I know. <laughs> you feeling all this activation going on inside you? Yeah. I'm ready to get up and run. Amen. <laughs> all this stuff in front of me, all this stuff around me has been blocking me from receiving mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's okay. It's okay. It is okay because everything you went through is going to be part of your ministry to other people. I've been flashing back a lot on my life growing up since I've had the Lord. I told you my religion beforehand, right? I was a Christian scientist for many, many, many years. I'm grateful for it. But when I realized I wasn't having a relationship with Jesus, then I started to, sh it shifted. Greatly. You repent of all that? You forgive yourself? I'm talking about everything <laughs> from your life. Well, when it comes up, I try to, yeah, I, I do. It's coming up. I'm, I'm yeah, yes. Because yes. things are lifting off of you right now, just like yeah. heavy weights are coming off of you right now. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Take it all to the cross. I just had a, a blowing away of, smoke or, or, or fog just now yeah mm. you see we forgive but we we don't we don't know how to let it go yeah yeah well lord just of... took it oh thank you lord yeah. thank you lord okay. how are you feeling right now i feel i mean i it's almost like that little child in me is going really it's okay you know that little girl in me you're free you know it's like I feel calm and I feel excited. It feels great. It feels great. It feels, it's going to feel better. I know it's going to feel like a, it's going to blow. It's going to be amazing because I can see it coming. Yeah. yeah. I can see it coming. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a, like the sun is just popping up. Amen. It's cloudy here today, but the sun is like bright. Amen. What would you say to anybody who has suffered like this? Well, I just am to be just so grateful to God. Just 
Feel your inner spirit and soul working. Feel, know there's connections. Know it's there. Don't let anyone tell you it's not. Believe in yourself. Believe in the self that God has for you, that God is in your life. You are created for a purpose. Go back in your life and see God everywhere that there was pain. See him standing there. Forgive, love, praise you, Lord. You know, God knew everything. And before I got on the call, all I could see was his heart, his heart for you. And there was a big hindrance in your life because of the curse that only the Holy Spirit knew about and could break. Yes, and the Holy Spirit is new for me in a way that I've never, like when I left the other religion, I had, you know, the Holy Spirit was clearer to me. I'd felt it, but I hadn't really, really spoken to him. Yeah. You know, had really walked with him. Would you like to? Yes. yes. So let's rededicate your life to Jesus. <laughs> Is that okay? Yes. Jesus, say, Jesus, I want to rededicate my life to you. Jesus, I want to rededicate my life to you. Be the Lord of my life. Be the Lord of my life. No hindrances. No hindrances. No religion. No religion. Cleanse no me of religion. all my sins. Cleanse me of all my sins. Fill me with your Holy Spirit. Fill me with your Holy Spirit. And write my name. Write my name. In the Lamb's book of life. In the Lamb's book of life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. JesusTodayMinistries.org. We are here to minister and to pray with you right in the comfort of your own home or your office. If you are seeking counseling, healing, deliverance, financial breakthrough, if you feel that there is a block or you're experiencing hindrance in your blessings, please know that God cares about you and all that concerns you. Hi, my name is Peggy Golden. I am a pastor and I have a master's in Christian counseling. God has made a way for people all over the world to receive counsel, healing, and deliverance through the use of technology right in your own homes. God heals, saves, and delivers his people every hour of the day. There is no distance for God. If you do not know God, if you are seeking him, or if you have found yourself in a situation that you need help getting out of, please know nothing is too hard for God. Please visit my website at jesustodayministries.org. 
you can get to know more about me there. And please remember to read the testimonials of what others have experienced by contacting this ministry. There is no fee, but you are able to make a donation. For those who are in the States as well as international clients, we can use voice or video chat on Skype, WhatsApp, Facebook Messenger, or Viber. I look forward to praying with you and all that God will do.